This can be a necklace, or this can be like studs. <laughs> that there is a poop pipe extender, so. We got a deal. Check this out. No buttons, no batteries, no cool. What do you got here, baby? I got my new ride. <laughs> but beer is only $3 a piece. <laughs> Where's the bathroom? So I know this guy is home. And uh, he saw me picking my shit up. But yet, he still has not come out to move his truck, which is on our side of the lot. So, yeah, it, and there's a tree there, so we're going to have a little trouble getting out unless he moves it. If it becomes too much of a hassle, I'll just tell him to come move his truck, maybe. So truck repairs are done and we left Lake Havasu. Um, no problems getting here. And now we are in Courtside. Yep, yeah. We are at Dome Rock, it's BLM land. So we are boondocking for free for 14 days. If you wanna stay, we're not gonna stay 14 days, but you can stay up to 14 days. Okay. We are here for the big RV show here in Courtside. Yeah, we drove through town yesterday and it looked really big. There's our <laughs> There is a lot of RVs There's here in There's gotta town. be a million Holy RVs here. Moly. RVers. RVers, yes. <laughs> yeah, it's, there's so many. It's the happening meeting place, mm -hmm. apparently. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, yeah, we're just off of the Highway 10 here, mm -hmm. and I can see it in the background, and uh, we probably could have got back quite a ways further, but really, it's not much noise from... Not no, the, yeah, no, not no, it was noise. pretty quiet last night. No. So, yeah. yeah, we're gonna go into town here in just a few minutes and take you into town. Yeah, let's do that. And the big uh, tent. At some point, I'm gonna get out, get out my e-bike and do a little riding around here. If you want to. Uh, there goes an e-biker right there. <laughs> a truck just went by. <laughs> but yeah, so let's get ready to go into town. Big tent. Yep. I like quartzite. Quartz is everywhere. I'm gonna try to figure out what to make out of this. Make some earrings. Some earrings. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Those I'll are drill, pretty heavy earrings. I'll drill a hole through it. <laughs> put a zip tie on it and you put it on your oh, ear. Here's another one. I can, this can be a necklace and this can be like studs. get it or we'll find yeah. another one at a better price on the okay out. how much was it yeah there's seven bucks there's a lot of seven bucks yeah, okay what else are we looking for uh water filtration systems and we found them for 59. 59. is what we want for the back of our toy hauler but they're a little spendy we're gonna wait for the price to come down we're cheap 
So we just had a little talk with the Moorite people, very nice people. Very nice, very yeah. nice. Yeah, and uh, he gave us some little insight on a deal on one of these canopies that go on the back of your fifth wheel. On that, so we can put it on our deck. Yeah, yeah. Goes so on our the deck. deck comes down and we can put this little canopy on. Yeah, I guess toy hauler, I should say. Yeah, toy yeah. hauler. <laughs> but yeah, it's cool. We've been looking for one, but they're kind of spendy, and right now they're having a deal because yeah. the RV show, I think. Yeah. So. so we are in the big tent, and yeah. it's taking a little while to get through it. It is pretty big, but I'd say less than 50% of it is RV related. Yeah. Um, but it is nice. I mean, there's lithium, cellular, um, looks like suspension. There's all kinds of there's things. There's all kinds of things. Um, Cooking, RV, yeah. pots and pans, knives, and all. RV resorts. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I still think it's worth coming. Yeah. Having a great time. Yeah. We've had a deal. Yeah. <laughs> Baby, you can't have one. <laughs> Maybe someday. And some slaw. All right. Food. 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 I'm gonna go right over here in a few minutes and get us a poop pipe extender. A what? A poop pipe extender. A poop pipe extender. Poop extender. Are you gonna get the um, water thing too over here? Yeah, and get some uh, water filtration system for us. Sweet. That there is a poop pipe extender. So your elbow that goes into the sewer at the RV uh, resort, a lot of times they're buried down in deep and uh, you are unable to twist the pipe in. Well, this extends it up so you can uh, extend the 90 and put your sewer hose on it. So, poop pipe extender. <laughs> what do you got here, baby? I got my new ride. <laughs> yeah. Uh, my new golf cart. <laughs> a little more in the golf cart. It's only a $9,000 golf cart. It's a cute little thing. It's cute. I don't think so. Oh, it's got a back seat even. Yeah, it's got a back seat. Wow. It's got a little trunk. You're not convincing me. Looks like they even have a RV repair center. Looks like they're putting on... Uh, accessories and stabilization control components. So a little bit of everything here at Courtside. I saw that earlier. Crazy people out here going, hey. Where are we going, ladies? We're going to the desert of Mars. <laughs> to the destination, the bar out in the desert. <laughs> Nelly E Saloon, AKA Desert Bar. Yeah, about a five mile drive off of the 95 on this uh, dirt road. I would say if you wanted to come out here in a car, as long as it's not low clearance, you could do it okay. It's a little rough in places, but- <laughs> It's a little rough. <laughs> um, yeah, not bad though. It's done, four wheel drive, not needed. No. no. Anyway, let's check it out. Uh, we've heard so much about this place, so. Yeah, we drove an hour and a half to get here. <laughs> hour and a half from Courtside, because, you know, we're on the other side of Courtside, but yeah. no, it took us an hour and a half to get here. It's going to be worth it. Let's All go right. check it out.
Um, I want a Coors Light. Is that gonna be awesome? $6. So lunch cost $32, but beer is only $3 a piece. <laughs> had some lunch and it was actually very delicious. Delicious, very good. A <laughs> uh, little bit on, uh, I don't know if you call it spendy, but it was a little bit. Um, but it we was great. We had two burgers and fries for $32, so yeah. it was kind of spendy. Well, spendy. But, but the burger uh, was, yeah, it was huge. Actually, so. it was really good food. Yeah. Um, yeah, I thought we were going to get nachos and hot dogs out here, but uh, <laughs> no. Um, There's this, no electricity right. out here whatsoever. It's all done by solar. Yeah. So they're all self-contained and mm -hmm. it's this place is an old uh, gold mine if we didn't tell you already. Yeah. And uh, actually it's really cool. I mean it's worth uh, the five mile gravel road drive it to is. get out here actually. I was wondering at first. I was like, oh, but yeah. yeah so it was well worth it. Heck yeah, we're awesome. in, yeah, if we're in the area again, we'll definitely make uh, more of an effort to come on a warmer day. On a warmer day. It's yeah. only about 48 and it's been <laughs> raining off and on, which is Amazing around here. It's they say it's been over 10 months since they've seen any rain. Yeah, so. they need rain here. So they need, they need it back. It's okay But yeah, it's right. awesome. Should we keep exploring? We should. All right. There's a lot more to see looking for a box on the side of the road. <laughs> All this for a block of wood. But you're like waving people over. <laughs> So a couple days ago we were going down the 95 and the Joneses were following us and they're like, did you hit a piece of wood or did something fly out of your truck? And we're like, no, nothing flew out of our truck. This was sitting below the bed, the top of the bed rail, a couple of inches, maybe three or four inches. And apparently some turbulence caught it and flipped it up over the tailgate and it actually put a dent in our trailer. 
and we're like, how could that thing come out? I mean, that thing is heavy. And so we'll have to be more careful from now on. Why y'all wet, babe? Yes, we're in Quartzsite, Arizona, <laughs> and it's storming outside, and our friends, the Joneses RV, would not start. But uh, I think it's a, a starter solenoid. We were able to jump it at the starter with a screwdriver. <laughs> Redneck. Yep. Whew. It's nasty. <laughs> This is Quartzsite, Arizona. Flash flooding. Oh. Oh, I'll get that. Hey, or is it going here? Okay, before. We lost the block. I don't know which one we, it was now, but no, the the block that we lost is inside. Oh, it's inside. Okay, yeah. it's all signed, and yeah. we'll use it later though. I think it's signed. So we had them stacked up like this, and I had I think one more up like this, and turbulence caught it and flipped it out of the back of the truck and actually put a dent in the side of the RV, yeah. and. Uh, yeah. Zima spotted it alongside the road when we went back that way the other day to go to the uh, the desert bar. So we stopped and picked it up. Because Zima's got keen eyes. So no to our veers. There is, and I knew it already. There was a lot of turbulence in this area um, because I had looked in the mirror before and saw stuff flying around once before and pulled over and caught it before it flew out. But there's way more turbulence right in this back area than you realize. So uh secure your stuff put it down low stack it so it doesn't you know can't get air underneath it and flip it out and so be careful all right this is the end of courtside yeah yeah it was a lot of fun though um the weather was a little eh, mm. you know it wasn't great actually um but this morning we woke up to heavy <laughs> rain and heavy winds yeah. and actually heavy winds all night yeah and we're headed to Yuma, and I saw that there was thunderstorms in Yuma, so I'm not excited about that. So. But the RV show here, I was a little disappointed in it. I don't know what it's like on non-COVID years, if there's more stuff than what we saw. Yeah. So I was a little disappointed in that. It was still fun. It was still, you know, yeah. neat to see it and go through it. The desert bar was... The best, awesome. Yeah, the desert bar was cool. <laughs> yes, highly uh, recommend the desert bar. Yeah, actually, we should have did that when we were in Lake Havasu. We yeah. Were, we would have been closer to it. So, but Whoops, that's my bad. <laughs> that's okay. I'm the planner. I screwed up on that one. But anyway. Yeah. So let's head to Yuma. Yeah. So don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button. And we'll see you all next week. Bye. Bye.